There to dream, there to believe, there to think, there to work, only then do you achieve. So, we have been talking much about gender-based violence in the world, in Cameroon, in Bamenda, and uh, it keeps occurring. Gender-based violence keeps occurring. It keeps occurring day in and day out. Day in and day out. In our local communities, in our region, and in the entire country. It is no news what happened in Boya the other day. And uh, that, was an, uh, that was an act of gender-based violence perpetrated by, by women on their fellow women. So, this is why we keep saying every day that we are all victims of gender-based violence and we are all perpetrators of gender-based violence in one way or the other. If we live our lives, keep thinking that gender-based violence or domestic violence only happens when it has gone physical, then we will only catch it after the act. But when we get to realize that before the battle of the feast comes the battle of the mind, then we will understand that if we fight the battle in the mind, we might be able to prevent the battle that comes with raising your fist towards another person. So it's about, it, it, it's a mind game. It's a mind game. We all grew up observing these acts of gender-based violence either being perpetrated on us or being perpetrated on another person or being perpetrated on a loved one of ours. And uh, statistics show that human beings learn by observation. The fastest way to which a human being can learn a behavior is by observing another person exhibiting that behavior. So consciously or unconsciously, you learn how to be how to carry out violent acts on people by just watching others doing it or by by it being done on you or by you doing it on another person so having that consciousness that it is in you having that consciousness that you have that tendency to be violent towards a fellow human will help you catch yourself before you perpetrate that act but if you feel like you're better off but than the one than the man who is beating up the wife you feel like you're better off than the wife who is beating up the husband you feel like you're better off than the mother who is lashing on the child for not just reason or you're better off than the father who is lashing off on the son for not just reason because he's transferring the aggression of what he went through then you will only realize that you are no better you are no better because remember remember and remember this very well that the danger in fighting evil is that you gradually become that which you fight so much to kill the danger in fighting evil is that you gradually become that which you fight so much to kill so remember that you have that tendency in you accept it then from there you will be able to catch yourself before you go violent no matter who you are. 